Good afternoon, my name is Scott Simmer, engineer paramedic for the Rincon Fire Department. Uh, today I will be going over the medical assessment for National Registry. So BSI, scene safety, uh, mechanism, mechanism of injury, nature of illness, how many patients do I have, is there a need for additional resources, is there a need for C-spine, what is my general impression of my patient, what's the level of consciousness of my patient, and what is his chief complaint. Next, I'm gonna walk up to my patient and do the uh, primary assessment. Is the airway open, patent, and clear? Is there a need for an oral adjunct? I'm gonna take a look at the breathing, rate, tidal volume, and quality, see if there's any oxygen therapy that is needed. Next, I'm gonna take a look at circulation. I'm gonna check his pulse, his skins, any overall bleeding, shock management. Now, I'm gonna go into the medical portion, which is a little different than the trauma assessment. So we start off with the OPQRST, onset, provoke, quality, radiate, severity, time. When did it start? What were you doing when it started? Describe the pain. Does the pain go anywhere else? Scale of one to 10, have you ever had this before? This before? Have you gone to the hospital before for this? Next, you're gonna move on to the sample history. Signs and symptoms, allergies, medications, past medical history, last oral intake, event leading to this situation. Next part of the National Registry is that you're gonna ask for secondary symptoms. Examples of this would be with chest pain, does it hurt more when you breathe in, palpating the chest, any nausea, vomiting, any JVD, any pedal edema. Uh, shortness of breath, do you have a throp orthopnea, proximal nocturnal dyspnea, symptoms of that nature. After that, we are gonna move on to the vitals. Vitals include blood pressure, pulse, respiratory rate, pupils, and we will also do diagnostic equipment at this time. Diagnostic equipment would include using a 12-lead EKG, um, a glucose monitor, capnography, or any of those types of devices. After that is all said and done, you're going to do the, your transport decision of load and go, stay and play. Uh, you're going to set up your plan for treatment. You are gonna reassess the vitals every five for critical, every 15 for non-critical, and then you're gonna reassess the primary airway every five minutes and treat all secondary. This concludes the medical assessment.